Today, I'm gonna to give you the top 15 questions to ask when selecting a PPC company, also known as a paid media agency. And I should know a thing or two about this because I've been running a paid media agency for the last 12 years and have been working in paid media for nearly 20. So in this video, we're gonna give you the top 15 things to ask as well as sample answers for that and some insights into what you should be thinking about when you're looking to hire a paid media agency this year. Okay, first, if you don't know what PPC agency means, it means pay per click. So that's kind of interesting. Let's make sure we understand that really quick before we get into the questions. Pay per click, it's an online advertising model in which an advertiser pays a publisher every time an advertisement link is clicked on. Now that's not the only way to run paid media ads. You can also run ads based off of impression and there's other models. But today we're talking more about a pay-per-click company, but we'll get into a paid media agency framework as well. So let's dive into the questions. The first question you're gonna to wanna to ask a PPC agency is how many years of experience do you have? Anyone who's been doing this for less than four or five years is gonna be pretty green and could be wasting your money. You're gonna be looking for a response that looks something like 10 years of experience with Google, Meta, Microsoft. You're also gonna be looking for people who have premium partnerships with each of those platforms as well. And how long they've had those partnerships is an important part of their experience. Question number two, can you describe your approach to PPC strategy and execution? A really good pay-per-click agency is gonna be providing forecasting, media mix modeling. They're gonna have engineering solutions to set up things like offline conversion tracking. Let me explain that really quick. This is a really important point. If you're e-commerce, you're gonna to wanna to be able to run your ads all the way down to the revenue level and track the amount of revenue that's coming from each ad. If you're on the lead generation side and you're running ads to generate leads with a pay-per-click agency, you're going to want to make sure you're able to take the revenue from a final customer and feed that back into the ad platform and use that to refine your ad strategy. Let's just spend one more second on that because this is a really important point. First, people just ran ads based off of impressions. Then they ran it just based off of the amount of clicks that they could get to the website. Then they just ran it based off of the amount of leads that they could get to the website. Then they started moving towards qualified leads to the website. Then they started moving towards sales qualified leads, meaning the sales team actually has qualified it. And this final piece is actually the final sale has been documented and pushed back into the ad platform so that you're running all your ads based off an actual sale. And that's what you're looking for regardless of the type of media you're running. Google has revenue for e-commerce and offline conversion tracking. Those are the two things you're looking for. Meta has something called Cappy that enables you to do this. And then also there's this whole world of third-party tools out there that a PPC agency might work with. Some of those tools are Hyros, Triple Whale, and there's a lot of others. Okay, question number three. What makes your PPC agency stand out from others? You'll be looking for things like case studies, the amount of awards that they've won in the industry from major publications, five-star reviews online that are real, and then partnerships, co-branded webinars with the major platforms are another thing to look at. When I say platforms, I mean Google, Meta, TikTok, etc. Also, you'll wanna understand their approach. Do they have specific things that they do that are models that allow their clients to be more successful? For example, we have our forecaster method and we have our certainty tech technology. Item number four is a really big one. How do you ensure transparency and client involvement with your PPC agency? Make sure you own all of your own accounts and the agency is not setting up stuff that you can't get access to. That's really, really important. Transparency is critical. Number five, what types of industries do you typically work in? They need some experience in your industry. They don't have to be 100% verticalized there, but they need some experience in case studies. Number six, how do you handle remarketing and how do you handle audience segmentation? This is really, really important because now we're moving towards a world where first party data is so critical. So they should be able to run ads to your YouTube channel, to people who have filled out a email form. Regardless, they should have an approach to running ads towards your data in a way that gets you the most customers. They should have a really clear approach to that. Number seven, what platforms does your PPC agency specialize in? Now keep in mind, I keep saying PPC agency, that's pay-per-click agency, but you're probably gonna be looking for a paid media agency, and that's somebody who can do things that are not just based off of clicks, especially when you're starting to consider these different platforms. Now the platforms is absolutely critical because different platforms matter for different business models. The platforms you're gonna to wanna to consider are Google Ads, Meta Ads, Microsoft ads, TikTok ads, LinkedIn ads, programmatic, and then of course, direct media buys. 
There's also others like Snapchat and Reddit and Pinterest, but most people will be starting with Google Ads or Meta Ads. Those are generally the most popular. Now keep in mind, when I say Google Ads, that also encompasses YouTube, the Google Display Network. When I say Meta, that also encompasses things like Instagram and more. Take the time to ensure that they run ads on the platform that you need to be the most successful for your specific business model, and they have a proven track record of doing that. The last thing you wanna do is launch a bunch of e-commerce ads on LinkedIn and waste money. Item number eight, ask your paid media agency, how do you measure the success of a PPC campaign? You should be looking for something like they define performance goals. What are your main KPIs? Obviously get that down first and where are you trying to go with the business and how can we use your paid media to match that? They're going to implement tracking. Remember the tracking I talked about earlier, the offline conversion tracking. They should have reporting and ongoing data analysis and insights, forecasting and measuring ROI and scaling the channels that work the best to have the best media mix for you to get the best return for the least money. Item number nine, a great question to ask is what is your approach to keyword and audience targeting and how would that look for my business? There are so many different ways to target customers online. For example, when you're working with an agency like Ignite Visibility, we focus a lot on location. Look, I've been doing digital marketing and paid media for a very long time. And one thing that I've learned is that it really matters where people are in the real world who are accessing these devices online. One zip code is completely different than another zip code. So when you layer on things like that, in addition to keywords and audiences, and then also things like gender and income status, affinity audiences, et cetera, you get a much better return for your money. Item number 10, a great question to ask a PPC agency is, can you give me examples of great paid media campaigns you've run recently? Item number 11 is critical. How do you integrate your PPC marketing with other digital marketing efforts? I talked about our forecaster method earlier. This is the type of thing to look for, but essentially what it does is it allows you to weigh all the different digital marketing channels against each other and see which is giving you the best return, but also have them all working together for the best media mix. Paid media alone is not enough. You need great landing pages. You need great creative. You need email marketing. You need SMS marketing. You need technology that nurtures and sets appointments and or does conversions if you're on the e-commerce side. Running ads is just a small part of it. You need to connect it all together. They should be able to speak to that. Item number 12, what are your billing and your contract terms? You wanna make sure that matches what you're looking for. Number 13, how do you stay up to date on PPC trends and changes? A good paid media agency, PPC company, they're gonna be reading publications like Search Engine Land. They're gonna be reading the Google Ads blog. They're gonna be watching the Google Ads YouTube channel. They're gonna be attending all the meta events. And they're gonna be working closely with each of these platforms and have a rep that keeps them up to date at least on a quarterly basis. Item number 14, ask your PPC agency, what's your process for adjusting strategy during a PPC campaign? For a really large enterprise paid media program, you could be looking at results hours. For some of the things that we've set up, we've had a report that's going out five times a day that shows how things are pacing for the day versus last year and also show how things are pacing for the day versus the forecast. And then based off of that, we can make adjustments on the state, the city level, the campaign level, the product level. And we have teams of up to 17 people that are working on something like that, that are providing robust insights, full-time insights people. That might not be what you need. Instead, you might need somebody who's just looking at things once a month and then making adjustments based off of what's getting the highest return and what's getting the lowest return or somebody who's doing that once a week. In general, a good cadence is at least on a weekly or a bi-weekly basis. Number 15, one of my favorite questions to ask and the last question today, what does the first 90 days look like and can I get a timeline for that? That's gonna allow you to understand what launch looks like, how quickly they're gonna get started, the returns they think they can get, what your spend's gonna look like, and also don't forget to ask who exactly you're gonna be working with. Those are the main questions to ask a PPC agency. A couple other bonus items would be, who are some references I can speak to? Making sure that they've managed spend at the level that you're looking for. Similar clients that are in the industry, similar clients that you've worked with. Do they have live dashboards that they offer? How often they provide forecasting? And will you have direct access to a director who can jump on the call if anything doesn't go in the right direction? Good luck finding the perfect PPC agency or paid media agency or whatever you want to call it. If you need any help, make sure to contact Ignite Visibility. We'd be happy to help you out. We'll see you next time. Have a great day. Goodbye.